So, guten tag, everyone. Uh, the new Linkin Park has just released a, uh, or premiered a new song on the, at their concert in Hamburg, Germany. It's called Heavy is the Crown. Uh, so, without holding back, let's uh, get into this. That's how you know when you change in the middle of the set. Next level, baby. Come on, dude, you're getting your finger in the camera. That's such a uh, amateur, you know, mistake to make. <laughs> it's like, it take a little long. I'm going to fast forward here a little bit. Let's go! So far, it's got the kind of basic riff, kind of a lot downstroking on that. Uh, your typical sort of, you know, it's a bit generic. I'm not too big a fan when they just, you know, downstroke uh, open unmuted chords. Uh, Mike's a, Mike's a great rapper. He's a great rhymer, always has a great flow. Uh, it's like, that's a classic Mike, uh, verse there. So far, right away, this uh, song is, you know, I, I've expressed before, I'm not a big fan of hers when it comes to her trying to sing Chester's, like the actual Linkin Park songs, you know, Chester songs. Uh, I don't think she's the right fit for that. Here, this is, this is fine. It's, you know, it's tailored to her voice. Uh, I've listened to a little bit of Dead Sarah, her band, which eh, it's more traditional rock, more. Like she has more of a like a Joan Jett, Janis Joplin kind of thing going on, and I find she struggles with Chester's stuff, trying to like scream as hard as he did, because he could just you know he was like a metal singer and can just handle it. Here she's more like, you know, she kind of sings that raspy, sings the raspy uh, lyrics and then kind of like screams a little bit at the end, and that's fits her. That's her style a little more than as versus the Chester. Nice little breakdown. Like I said, I'm a, not a big fan of the guitar work here. A little simplistic, and I, as a guitar player, I like a little more meat in my riffs. But that's fine. Uh, like I said, great. Oh, Mike's great in this. Uh, it fits better for Emily.
Trying to go for the heart scream there. I think she kind of died out a little bit at the end there or got drowned out. Looks like she's got some huge soles on her shoes. This is a bit of a nitpick with her. Uh, she's my age, she's 38, but since she's joined Lincoln Park, she's kind of dressing like she's a Zoomer or something. Like these young 20 something year olds are trying to bring back the baggy pants and the you know, giant shoes and all that. And it looks like that's the end. Uh, like I said, uh, song's fine for the for her. It, it, it fits her style. This is kind of it's right along with what she does with Dead Sarah. Uh, you know, uh, so I guess that's the end of this review here. Uh, uh, if you liked it and you don't like it, let me know in the comments. Uh, like and subscribe to my channel. I'll catch you later.